It's super cool to see all these fire trucks everywhere. You're the Ugh, it looks nasty outside again still. Look at all that. What are we doing? Vlogging. What are we doing? We're vlogging. No, oh, we're vlogging, but what are we doing while we're vlogging besides driving? <laughs> That's what I was going to say next. <laughs> we're donating. What are we donating? Some dog food that Bentley doesn't like. So instead of just throwing it away or, or holding on to it until it expires. Or trading it in. Or trading it in. We figured we would donate it so that other doggies in need could have some doggy food. Hopefully they like it better than Bentley does. Yeah, that's for sure. <laughs> well, at least if they're hungry enough, they definitely want it. But unfortunately, when Bentley ate this um, specific flavor, he went and puked a few hours later. So we didn't want to um, chance it anymore with his uh, intestinal digestive issues and stuff. So we figured we'd stick with the ones that he uh, can actually keep down. So. I'm sure there's nothing wrong with the food, it's just his digestive system and he's just having a hard time digesting certain flavors and whatnot. And there's a lot of traffic out today, supposedly. I'm surprised there's a lot of people out and for how bad it is out here. And like the air quality is like 170 something or whatever, which is actually really bad. At least it's not 500. That'd be really, really, really bad. Huh. Yeah. Alright, so we brought Mr. Gintley's with us for this little road trip here. Yep. He loves the car. He just like, it's like his happy place. He just loves it. He's just like, <sighs> Yeah. Alrighty. Let's go take the food and go and donate it. Please? Hi. Hi. What are we doing? We're leaving where we just dropped off the food. We're vlogging. We're vlogging. He's nuts tonight. Whatever. Um, yeah, so we're at the uh, Happy Trails uh, Barkery, and uh, yeah, we just gave them some of that wet food. So, off we go back home with Mr. Bentley's. Mr. Bentley's, hey boo! Bentley's! He always ignores us in the car. What is up with that? Oh, he's overly comfortable and he's just living his, in his own happy world. Yep. Most definitely. Yep. And when we went into the place, there was a little girl that wanted to pet all the animals that were coming in. And uh, Bentley let her pet her. He didn't bark at her at all. It was super cool. Huh. Super cool? Super duper cool. Super duper duper cool. The coolest of cools. Yeah. Alrighty. Like other people are vlogging. Yep. The guy's vlogging with his phone. Yeah, the guy was vlogging with his phone and it looks like they're either dropping off stuff or picking up stuff. I'm not sure, but they had boxes that said donations on it. So, that's cool. Yeah, they said that they're going to put our name on a donation wall and all that fun stuff. So, yeah. That's cool. Sweet. All right, now we're going to take Mr. Bentley's back home. And uh, this afternoon we're going to go watch a movie because it's super bad outside. We still can't do anything outside. Nor would we want to do anything outside because it's so hot out. So either way, we got to do indoor stuff. Yep. yep. We're going to do that indoor stuff indoors. <laughs> Duh. Hey, you guys want to hear something crazy? All right, so this fire, I, that's all we see on our Facebook page, by the way. If you're scrolling around on Facebook, if you live in this area, it's just fire, 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 fire. Whew. So, this fire has gotten so far about out of control. I mean, they're kind of sort of pulling it in now, but it's still growing a lot. Our air quality, I, mean, I can show you some of these numbers, right? Like, check us out checks out all right so this website right here look at that 125,842 acres 35 percent contained there's you want to see how many people are on this look at this there's currently 4,271 personnel on this fire wow 369 fire trucks are out there they got 69 different fire crews 17 helicopters 125 dozers working on the stuff and 84 water tenders. Wow, that is insane. I checked the uh, air quality in Reading. So this is just a little map of, you know, 
what the air quality colors are with the numbers on them over here and then we've got if you scroll down a little bit it explains like what each one means you guys can like pause here and read those if you want here's the current air quality in Reading. okay here we go currently 204 let me refresh just to make sure it's the same oh look it went down 175 yay so apparently this morning it was like 350 something um, and then when I was checking a little while ago, it was 20, whatever it just was, 206. And now it's 175. 175 puts us in the dark orange, which was over here. It's in the red, so unhealthy. That's where we're at. Isn't that crazy, you guys? Wow. I mean, this fire has just been, I mean, it's been over a week that this fire's been burning. Fire started, here let's see, it shows on here when it started. The actual start date of the fire was July 23rd. So it's been since July 23rd that this thing has been burning and burning and burning. You go outside and it's just smoky haze out there. Like I don't even want to go out there. I've hardly been outside in the past week. Like I go out when I have to and that's it. So it's a little nuts. It's a little bit on the crazy side. But luckily we got these air purifiers. We got one for our bedroom. I don't know if we showed you that one. We got the big one that you guys saw us unbox. And then we got this little guy right here for our bedroom. Isn't that pretty? Down there, there's our little air purifier. It's got a couple of different mo modes on it. So we can choose if we want it to be like on whisper mode for when we go to sleep or medium or quick clean. It just goes really high, really fast and just pushes all the air through but we, we've been putting it on uh, whisper mode for while we're clean while we're sleeping because it's nice and quiet and it keeps cleaning the air in our room you know and I got the fan running that way um, the air keeps moving throughout the house I got all the fans on and we got to get this thing clean man do a little check outside here let's see yeah the sky still looks all grungy and like orangish so that's your fire update. Um, I don't know what else to to say about that. I just can't wait till it, it goes out because we're we're so sick of living in this horrible condition that we're in. So sooner the better. Sooner the better. Now, funny little fact. I went the other day. I don't know if you ever have heard of nutritional yeast seasoning, but um, I needed it for a recipe that I cooked the other day. I had to go to like the vitamin shop because that's it's like a specialty item. I couldn't just get it at the grocery store. I could not find it there before. So I had to go to a specialty vitamin shop and buy it. And it was like $7 or something like that. And then I forgot to put it in my <laughs> recipe. <laughs> uh, oops. Oops. Alrighty, peeps. So we are going to dinner now. And we found all these fire trucks in our um, area here. So we're going to drive by and I'll let you know which uh, towns they're from because it's super cool to see all these fire trucks everywhere. So we have Redwood City. Hi Redwood City. And then over on this side uh, we have one that says Paramedic and I don't know where that's from. San Mateo Fire Truck. Here we have a Woodside Fire District. Central County. Central County right here. And then over here on this side we have Menlo Park. Palo Alto. Palo Alto, yep. Look at all their stuff on the side there. It's pretty cool. And then uh, we got this one over here, which is Los Angeles. Los Look Angeles. at that. Whoop, whoop. Hello there. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So we thought we'd drive through there and uh, you know, show that off because it's pretty cool to have all those different fire trucks here. Huh. Yeah, there's a little pickup truck over here. I don't know where they're from. Yeah. We're gonna drive right back because we're going to dinner at Famous Dave's because we want some ribs. Ribs. We've been talking about ribs like all day long and we're like, we don't have time to make them, we wanna make them. Woodside. Woodside. Okay. Woodside cool. Fire District. Alrighty, so that's pretty cool. So we're gonna come over here and uh, get some grub. Wait for some grub a dub dub? Oh, yeah, I'm ready for some grub. Yeah. Hungry. Let's go eat. Welcome to Famous Dave's. That's where we're at. We're getting our grub on with this pretty amazing looking meal. Let's check it out. Whoa, look at all that food. You got 
corn, corn muffin, bread. cornbread muffins. You get some fries. You get some uh, corn on the cob, coleslaw, baked beans, chicken, ribs, and beef brisket. Yeah. Beef brisket right there. It's right there. There you go. Cool. And it's all clattered on a trash can lid. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Fun, huh? Yeah. Let's dig in. All right, let's eat. All righty, peeps. So, uh, welcome to the end of the video today. And I uh, hope you all enjoyed. Uh, we had some fun getting out and doing things, even though it's smoky out and whatnot. But yeah, donating is always a good thing to do. We had fun at Famous Dave's. So if you want to see some other videos, click to right or left or whatever over there on that side, and you can see our other videos. And our videos aren't always about fires, but that's the big thing that's going on right now. So if you haven't subscribed yet, smash that subscribe button down below and ding that little bell over there so you can get notifications of our videos when they come up. So we'll see y'all next time because love does it.